Hey kids. Hey troop. Hey Miss Kelly. Hey kids. Happy Sunday. Happy Sunday. Okay troop, are you ready to get started? Let's do it. Here we go. Wow. Okay troop, did you bring today's fruit of the spirit? I sure did. Let me get it. One second. Okay. Troop, what is this? It's peas. Peas, troop. I said peace, not peas. Peace, like P E A C E. Yeah, peas. No, troop, these are peas, the vegetable. They're not even a fruit. Oh, uh, oopsies. That's okay, Troop. We can still talk about peace anyways. Uh, so, Miss Kelly, what is peace anyways? I'm so glad you asked, Troop. Peace is the freedom from being afraid or worried because we know that God is in control, so we don't need to worry. He has the whole world in his hands. The whole world? Yeah. The whole world, the wind, the waves, the good and the bad, he controls it all. Wow, uh, you know, sometimes I think I have peace, but uh, I still get afraid. That's okay, Troop. And you know what? That reminds me of today's story, when some of Jesus' friends were with him and they still got afraid. Let's listen and see. Here we go. Stories of the Bible. Jesus calms the storm. This is Jesus, hey who is the Son of God and the Savior of the world. While Jesus was on earth, he taught everyone about God's love and healed people from their sickness. He did many miracles like walking on water oh, hey and even raised people from the dead. One day after preaching to a crowd of people, Jesus said to his disciples, let's cross to the other side of the lake. You got it. So they got into a boat and started out. Other boats followed him too. And as they sailed across, Jesus fell asleep. But soon a fierce storm came down on the lake. The boat was filling with water and they were in real danger. The disciples went and woke Jesus up, shouting, Hey, yeah, wake up! Save us! We are going to drown! Don't you care if we drown? Jesus responded, Why are you afraid? You have so little faith. Then he got up and rebuked the wind and waves, saying, Silence, be still. Suddenly the wind stopped and there was a great calm. Then he asked them, Where is your faith? The disciples were terrified and amazed. Who is this man? They asked each other. When he gives a command, even the wind and waves obey him. The wind and the waves were just roaring and crashing all around, and Jesus just spoke and stopped it all. That's so right, Troop. God is in control. We don't need to fear because he can silence all those things with just one word. Wow! You know, sometimes it's easy to forget that God is in control, and we can feel scared and worried, and we can lose our peace. But all we need to do when that happens is three things. Oh yeah, what's that? Three things, we need to stop, we need to pray, and remember that God is in control. Stop, pray, and remember, God is in control. That's right, Troop. Okay, Troop. Okay, kids, that's all for today. We'll see you next week when we talk about our next fruit. See you then.